Yeah, um, yeah. Obviously, um, condolences to his family, um, all those closest to him, and uh, yeah. I, I mean, I obviously just heard the news as well, and I can't recollect actually coming across him uh, during my travels, but uh, well aware of his uh, standing as a manager and, um, you know, his record uh, um, both at club level and national team level. Um, and more importantly, I think, uh, you know, you see the measure of the man when, um, you know, the people who are sort of giving the tributes today. I mean, I just heard, uh, you know, Ali McCoyce to... Uh, eloquently put it that uh, he was just a great man and um, you know a sad loss for for Scottish football um, for sure uh, but someone who uh, like all of us we, 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 we all want to sort of try and uh, make our mark as people as much as as uh, in our profession and uh, he's one of that rare breed that definitely did that. Yes, mate. Yes, yes, yes. Australia, I know, but yeah, well aware of Walter Smith, mate. Um, well aware of his record at, like I said, at Rangers, um, with Scotland at Everton. Um, his standing uh, in the game uh, worldwide um, is, yeah. Trust me, I, I I know him very, very well, and and particularly, I guess, the era that I grew up. Um, you know, he was one of those. Uh, you know, people who you knew uh, had a great standing in the game, uh, even from the other side of the world. So I can assure you that his uh, loss will be felt uh, globally and and Australia, absolutely, because uh, as I've said many times, there's a, a really strong, um, you know, expat community there that, uh, you know, from Scotland, UK, who would be, uh, as I said, uh, saddened by his loss. You know, the rivalry with Celtic and Rangers now, it takes a special man to, to bridge that gap, and that was something that he did. I mean, the outpouring of emotion from Celtic fans to be sort of showing the respect he has in. Yeah, as I said, you know, we, we all try and live the best life we can possibly live and, and, and try and, you know, um, set the highest possible sort of standards for ourselves as in our profession and as people, but it's not easy, but... Yeah, you know, like I said, he's one of that rare breed that that is that that you know. I, I don't know. I guess for me, uh, for all of us, for somebody to say that we were a great person goes beyond just what we did, and um, and I think that's what you're you're sort of referring to. That irrespective of rivalries or who he managed, or you know, um, people saw the man and um, had nothing but respect for him.